Dan Walker broke down in tears while watching his former BBC breakfast colleague John McGuire host a piece on the 78th anniversary of Normandy's D-Day. Dan made his debut appearance on Channel 5 at 5 News last night. Taking to Twitter this morning, Dan wrote in view of his 761 7K followers, what a beautiful piece on the Normandy Memorial from a John Mag 20 on at breakfast. The tears are flowing, he added. Martin agreed, it was an excellent piece, just a shame that the focus was elsewhere on such a sacred day. Lest we forget, Little Erfer wrote, extremely moving interviews. Knowledge and dignity always from John, he covers these stories so well, and Martin. Dan also tweeted to say he was quite happy with the viewing figures after he hosted the Channel 5 News show for the first time last night. Lots of talk about figures last night. We are quite happy with ours. He wrote alongside a laughing face emoji. The at 5 underscore news audience was up over 70%. Thanks so much for watching, he added. We'll see you tonight at 5, on 5. During his debut, Dan spoke with MP for Great Yarmouth and Secretary of State for Northern Ireland Brandon Lewis and made a subtle nod to his previous job. He was standing outside Downing Street in London ahead of Boris Johnson's confidence vote on Monday evening. Touching on how the discussions went and what the atmosphere was like inside the House of Commons, Dan asked Mr Lewis, it is really good to get you on the programme. Dot referring to his previous stint on the BBC, Dan said, In my previous life, I have spoken to you on many occasions when you have been firmly supporting the Prime Minister, what do you see in him that many of your fellow MPs don't? Mr Lewis replied, Well, there are a couple of things actually, first of all, the Prime Minister is somebody who does connect with the public when you are out and about with him. People do connect with him, but I think also because working with him as Prime Minister, what I see is someone who has been absolutely laser focused at all times on trying to deliver things and do the right thing to help the people in our country. Whether it's through Covid and making the decisions around how we deal with it and how we come out of it, whether it has been about issues in Northern Ireland where he has focused on delivering for people or the issues coming out from the war in Ukraine. His focus is always on what are we doing that makes the lives of our constituents better? Watching his first broadcast on 5 News, viewers flooded to Twitter to give their praises and wish him further luck in his career. Humon praised, all the best at hashtag 5 News. And nice, gentle start. Only a prime minister is under threat. Apart from that, ho oh hum. Ed Hollis added, hashtag 5 News with at Mordane Walker great start to at nice and gentle Monday, enjoy and best of luck. At Posh B1 said, at Mordane Walker. Wishing you all the best, Dan starting your new job and new chapter on Hashtag 5 News.